By zero to death from like zero to like one. Oh, just like straight up combo. Yeah, straight up combo Damn. city, and like he just couldn't do anything. And that's not how I remember. I, I played him when I was bad, and you know I I like to think I was bad like a few months ago. Uh, <laughs> not saying I'm good now. I was just bad then. Yeah. Oh, that he should have definitely blew up his sticky there. Oh. All right, he's a good point. Okay, he hasn't blown up. He still has a loose sticky. He should be blowing that up in some of this free time he has. Yeah. Uh, because at any, he could have done a drop sticky there. He could have done a lot. I guess he doesn't need it on this map, arguably. Uh, but I don't know. Have your options open. Yeah, definitely. Like, yeah, there would have been another. There, this is perfect. Okay, there we go. Uh, that was bad on Robum. Not keep it. I guess this is people not having experience with Snake because Robum had a jump. To be able to get over that, but he just he did the thing where he just said, "I'm gonna go straight to ledge," and that is inevitable death. Yeah. Uh, he's gonna plant mine. See plant if he does mine? it again. Okay. He, he got over it this time, but it still blew up, which is like he was probably like pixels off death right there. You know what I, f I found out this uh, recently? Actually, like the best way to kind of like get rid of the mines on the field is just to like run up and shield like Smash Four. Yeah, you could you could slide you could sliding shield into them. You could, yeah, just run uh, shield and it balls rolling up. up gets rid of them. If you got perfect sweet spot on ledge, you can roll up and get rid of them. There's a there's yeah. a lot of little tactics. Uh, <laughs> we up smashed it. In my experience, Mars down tilt can hit it in a safe range. Yeah, but it has to be like pixel perfect tipper. Uh, there's some other characters who have like their moves actually have options to get rid of it. Most of the disjointed characters, yeah, uh, can do it. Robin just looks like he's having a hard time figuring out this matchup. It's it's a lack of knowledge in the matchup. Yeah, uh, it definitely is. Because uh, like Falco should like usually has a has the advantage on this stage. I feel like also you you could see him starting these. Uh, this is I'm gonna I'm gonna give some notes to, Ooh, to nice. Robin here, it, but you could see him starting these like um, build a combos. Like he he learned a combo. Dare to shine to up tilt to dare or something like that. Maybe dare to shine to dare, and you see him do it even when he whiffs. Uh, I don't know if you'll see it because he's not starting up. But I saw him yeah. starting up and his 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 shine wouldn't have hit. But he still did the shine and jumped again. So it's it's a kind of a lack of regard for percentage. I'm imagining yeah. Robin is sick at sick at tech, and when Robin you know, plays at home and like practices, it looks like silky. But then the awareness of actually playing in tournaments for some people is a big adjustment. Yeah. Because you can see, like, that shine was clearly out of range, right? Mm hmm And it, those are those oh. are important because if you get stuck in shine and it missed, you're in bad shape. Yeah. Good he, good choice. This is That was a really wise choice. Uh, yeah. Oh, wow. Ooh, I don't know if you saw what uh, LSD did there. So if he places another mine, the moment he stops placing it, the first one blows up. So it has a larger blast radius than it does sensitivity radius. So yeah. what he can do is blow it up even if someone isn't in range by placing a second one and still get them. He uses it a lot against Moy during Moy sets when Moy would do uh, ether up B. He would actually uh, blow up the mine right as Moy was like on his up on the up B. Oh, before he hit, got ledge. Before he got ledge. Yeah. It was, it was really smart. smart. Dude, I love watching Snake and PM. It's just like... One of the, some of the funnest matches like you can watch. We'll see if he maintains it throughout the tournament, but I know he said he, he kind of wanted to drop Snake. His Falcon's looking really good. If he yeah. ever loses a game, you're going to see his Falcon come out hella quick. Oh. Okay, he wants bigger. He yeah, wants, he, he wants he Dream Lane. Wants bigger. Oh, that just, wasn't the best that was, No, it wasn't. No, no. He wanted space so the mines can cover in this, this stage. Mines and, and like the yep. dead charge. You can put mines on those platforms and just like set up for days. Well, it's it's mine, debt charge, and grenade. That's like three quarters of the stage covered at any given second as yeah. he continues to play. See, he's got debt charge on half the stage. <laughs> he's setting up mine. He's setting up debt charge again. Oh, there it's, it is. Yeah, he can just knock them into those moving platforms so easily. Yeah, that was a down tilt. That's, that's disgusting. Yeah. <laughs> Takes him off stage, decides to arm grenade, does not throw it. <laughs> yeah. I tell you, it's a little sloppy. Like, he might be doing well here, but I don't trust it yet. Oh, he's going for the finisher. He got oh, it. Oh, he got the Sakurai. He got Base it. Sakurai, dude. Yes, let's go. That was good. That was good. He's got to be feeling himself now. Now Rob, he's Rob oh. looking super hype. Oh. Okay, what do you do oh. during someone's invincibility? Do not full hop. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Sitting in, sitting in shield isn't even a bad option. I, I like for melee, this is won't work here, but melee left and likes to go to a platform and light shield as soon as the person hits the ground. Oh, jab reset to re-grabs. Dude, Snake is like, that's all Snake's game is, is just re-grabs. Yeah, you see, he's, he had uh, he had his mine and his debt charge. That's one third of the stage covered. Yeah. And as soon as he takes out grenade and then him himself, that covers the entire ground. 
and but, like uh, most of the options. Oh. Rob Robums might be feeling comfortable here. This might be his, his stage. Okay, he's planted now. Yeah, he's dead. He's dead. Oh wait, wait. You know what? I thought mine would actually land on that platform because he was so low. He's still got him sticky though, and like this is Robum's in a bad. I position. like his patience. He needs to get back to the ground without getting hit. He did not. He didn't. Uh, he didn't even use the sticky. Like there was a couple opportunities. I think he, he actually did. He used the sticky to break up laser pressure right there. Oh, that's okay. what he used. It oh, for. I, no, that, I thought he exploded the mine. No, no, okay. that was that was a sticky to to break up laser pressure. Gotcha. It was actually a really smart choice. He just stuck him again. If you didn't see, yeah, I did. So I now was... now Falco's in a really disgusting position. He needs to get back to the ground, and he needs to be not landing in front of his shield because all that LSD wants at this point is he grabs. needs to, like he basically just needs to get Falco at that height mm -hmm. that you need. He's going for grabs, dude. dude like, he is. Uh, you need to stay oh. short hop like fair short hop near short hop bare short hop drill just just throw him out there man yeah uh because all he wants is a grab and he's gonna be dumb for it so oh the laser pressure Woo, almost laser pressure. that that was actually he uh air dodged in place probably the smartest air dodge he could have done there yeah uh i don't know if it was intentional or if it was uh he thought he was l canceling his forward air oh he got the soccer right again again nice jesus Robin may keep right, this interesting. LSD's looking bad I, I almost want my prediction to come true i want to see his falcon and his falcon's looking good right now yeah I'd be interested to see. I played him in uh, Falcon. Ooh, he barely got Firebird to land on stage. He did the thing. He did the thing. He okay, the thing. he's living though. Good DI. Up, he straight up. Good, clean. He's gonna have to, <laughs> yeah, come back on the stage somehow. Oh, there nice. All he wants is that grabs. You, there see, we you go. see that three whiff grabs in a row? Like that's that's all LSD is looking for right now. And you could, if you read it, you could punish it over and over again. LSD looking. Oh, okay. Got the back air. Got the but, back air. But this is in Falco's favor right now. Yeah. That oh, oh my god, oh, that could have been doing? so bad! <laughs> Up e. Grenade's trying to get back on the oh, stage. Up so good. He's going for it again! Oh, he, he, pulled, he pulled out. He actually he, it was good because I think he would have got punished. Oh! Wow. Maybe he should have gone for it. Dude, no. he, dude, if he would have gone for that, man, like... I think he got scared. That could have been it. Uh, if he had, I think LSD was coming down Damn. with something safe. So yeah. I think he would have would have countered it. Maybe a good choice. What he did afterwards is the issue. His mid-game was a little sloppy. He was getting grabbed. And he wasn't recognized yeah. he was getting grabbed. Because all you got to do when the snake's pressuring you to grab is uh, drill to shine or, like, just run around with some nares. Just cross him up nair, and you're going to just stop him.